What is up YouTube? This is Asian 58 here and I'm going to be bringing you my first playthrough play, uh, play of Civilization 4 Warlords. So let's get it started. I shall yeah, definitely play now. Uh, well, I'll choose Fractal because I have never had Fractal type map in any other type. You should play Continents. But I'll try Fractal this time. Like uh, I actually played it before at previous game. Like everything here, temperate and moderate. It seems right to standard size. I don't want a huge map because if you have a huge map, you have more civilizations. And even though it's more of a chance of them being uh, crowded, like being squished back to the corner so I can have more land, it's higher chance of me being squished back. So, you know, more civilization has more possibilities. I want to keep it as standard as possible. Um, although I do want to play a new civilization, I, I feel most comfortable for trying out Korea. I want to do Japan. However, I think I should keep to Korea because these guys are unique and exclusive to Warlords and if I ever do play through again I will do on Beyond the Swords which is another expansion pack for uh, Civilization 4 and for there I feel like I need to finish Japan because I've, start I've started a Japan campaign before but I have not finished it so I'll save it for Beyond the Sword. What should I call it? Yeah, I was gonna call it Kimchi but it seems too cheesy. So, for purposes of uh, the commentary, I should actually put a warlord because um, normally I do noble, but this involves so much. Oh, okay, I'll, I'll start it right now. That involves so much saving and starting over again because that's what I do for a noble. I just keep saving and starting over, and just I just keep doing that. It's ridiculous. It's it's just so annoying, and I don't think it's good for the commentary. It's the commentary and playthrough, it just feels dirty and I just want to keep it as clean as possible so I won't have to stress myself out and have to make ridiculous uh, decisions. Then again, it's uh, you know, it's not totally ridiculous, but whatever. Anyways, yeah, so, Hacha, is your catapult, which is ridiculous because instead of a guy that throws rocks, you get a guy that shoots like a thousand rockets out. <laughs> it's pretty ridiculous, like really. is. uh, how the heck do people, how the heck do you get something that shoots up rockets when you haven't discovered gunpowder? Ooh, this is a nice spot. There's some nice, there's a, actually, um, hopefully there's a hill here or, or a hill here because I want the hill for mining later on. So I would love to park it there, but this is a nice spot. Yeah, ooh, there's, I didn't notice that spice there. Okay, you know what? I'm planting the city here. This is a very, oh my god, this is a beautiful city. There's like three re types of resources nearby. Oh, I missed a hill, but whatever. You know what? I got, I got these for late game uh, stuff. Oh, two double, double, double spices. I got cows here. I got, I got rice here, and I got bananas. So what I should be learning is, uh, oh, what should I be learning? I always go for. I know I'll go for farming because I need that farm for the rice. Now I shall visit that village. So let's get this going. Now I'm a little bit on edge. Ooh, money. I always like the money. But yeah, uh, hopefully one of these stuff. Whoa, so much resources here. That's this is so much happiness in people. Okay, so people. So once I learn um, calendar, it should be happy, so I can get decent stuff. Oh, well, that's later game. I go up to this hill for some scouting and see what's up here. Oh, I'm near the water now. As being Korea, I get one extra gold for every um, place that gives more than one gold. So basically, if it gives two gold or more, I'll get three gold. If it gives three gold, I get four. And that's great for me. So that that's definitely good. I am near water. I got I can plant city here. It'll get wow. It'll get it get silk, banana, and it'll be near river. So that's really good because being near river early game means that you can build farms and expand your civilization. That's excellent. Now usually I would honestly uh, before now was uh, say newbier. I would build a worker, but I. I say nah, no workers. So yeah, animal husbandry, uh, pottery. Nah, nah, animal husbandry. I'm not gonna build. I'm not gonna build a worker anytime soon. Once I build a worker, I'll build a cottage to get my money growing. Oh, someone else found a food. So it's okay. I'm okay with that. Uh, give me a second to pause this. Okay, uh, sorry for the hiccup there. Just want to double check if stuff's going well. And this, oh, and then I have met my first animal here, a panther. I was expecting a bear, but you don't see bears in the jungle. 
Okay, one of my friends will find it. I find it good how in this in the warlords they decided. Ooh, silk. Oh, I feel like I was saying how they decided to reduce the size of the units. Like before, if the worker any any group of units, you would have like three units in it, and that would be good. That would be good for like animation purposes. I'm guessing some people can handle it in their computers, and the fact that you would have derpy combat. Like you would see like <laughs> you literally have an archer look at a warrior and he would just die from that. So I'm guessing since this is Warlord and Warlord obviously means more combat, then I guess the idea to reduce the you know unit. To oh my God, a worker! I've never had it before. Free worker. Okay, uh, don't die, dude. Anything, please, please don't die. Yeah, having to reduce it is a good idea. Blessed shall ah, be the fruit of thy cattle. This is a nice the spot for the city. Kind and the flocks of thy that nice spot, perfect spot. So I am guessing I should do pottery first, and I wanted to write it. Writing is what I want. I'm guessing pottery. Why does it recommend to do fishing? I am not. I am not right beside the fucking rivers. Maybe that uh, coastal line. So go back there. Come on, come on, faster! Don't die. I hope no one's here. I don't want to jinx it though. <gasps> Flooded plains. Flooded plains are like perfect for expanding stuff. So, uh, not Stonehenge. I want to do a worker, but I have one already. So, I'm guessing I should do barracks. Whatever I do is I always decide. Oh, fuck, Rome. Whatever. I gotta, I gotta get the resources before they do it. It looks like they get soaked too. What was that? I saw that. Gold. Fresh water. I mean, flooded plains. It's so. I mean, spice. I want this place here. I want this place. It's like my third expansion, third city. Aim for that. Probably Rome will get it first, unfortunately. No, of course no one to declare war. I think they're over here. Right over there. This is a very nice corn. To corn marbles. Oh my god, this place is perfect. Ah, Vikings. Okay, you know what? I'm guessing, I'm gonna, I'm guessing that wine there will be theirs. I'll have to negotiate. With them. Hath not the potter power over the clay to make one vessel unto honor and another unto dishonor? Okay, um. To do, I'm guessing I will do hunting so I can get some archers out. Barracks for that. Keep growing. Walking around, dudes. This is a very nice place. If you chase two Excellent. rabbits, you will lose them both. So archery, then I'll do bronze working, and then I'll do writing. I definitely need that writing. Oh, I can't get that. However, I can. What I can do is I can't get the cows. <gasps> At <sighs> Aztecs. I hate you guys. In this other, in my other game, he was a complete scumbag. He was always hating me. He always wanted to kill my ass. This is just my other game. It, it, everything was random. But it seems I have gotten, I've gotten Caesar again. I have gotten Vikings again. I have gotten Aztecs again. What the heck? Th th this isn't random. What the hell? It's scumbag again. Hate that guy. Fucking yeah. okay. He's he's beside uh, Caesar. That's good. It seems that they're all in one area. So they won't be out to about him for maybe a few turns. That seems good. Do Archery. not throw the arrow which will return against you. Of course, of course. Well, I might do that. <laughs> That's called a boomerang, actually. Uh, bronze working, I guess. Bronze working, and then we'll do writing. Okay. So we'll explore this area first. I'll put an arch and I'll be a settler. Because I want my city to grow a bit first. Just keep going. No, wait. Why aren't you working a rice farm? Wait, they are. Derp. How is that? Oh, it's five. I swear I said four. Sand go. Actually, we've had enough food here, so let's get some more monies. I think I'll send them back afterwards. You know what? I'll build a skeleton. Oh my god, this place is filled with resources. I'm just seeing land empty. What the heck? How, how do you expect to cross this place? You know it's clearly empty. Now we'll build a settler. Perfect timing. And being defensive, I like that. So I'm guessing I should build a coastal city here. Capturing that stuff. 
not aim for that the uh, aim for those stuff Blech. aim for uh this area here sorry about that silk requires plantation f my life okay Wait, I sh you know it is better to go to yeah whatever it is It is entirely seemly. Nah, I don't like slavery. Slavery is a bad idea. To lie mangled so by the Corey, you don't need Corey to have someone to writing. All things appear yeah, I'll do writing. Going on a farm here. Let's get to there. I'm just gonna keep expanding while that guy flies back here. I'm gonna need that clam for later. Very late game. Oh! Oh, another nice. Bo oh, gems! Gems. Gems are making people happy. And I just build, I need to build a mine there. It's very very good for me. So I'll build that set there. Everyone can go happy. Granity for expansion. And I shall expand this way. Uh, hill, actually. Yeah, I'll expand to the hill. Because the hill is great for Korea. Not only does it give defense for everyone else, but like they naturally get a. See this guy, he naturally gets. Naturally gets like they, they they get free promotion for archery units and archery units love hills, so that's a great spot for me in case if anyone declare it declares war. Maybe like an awesome stronghold. So both here, you should win. If you lose, you're pathetic. Good. Writing. Glory consists in doing what deserves to be written. In writing, what deserves sorry, to I, be Sorry, I'm read. sorry you can't hear it, guys. But I love the quotes. They're very awesome, but. Okay, sorry for this weird uh cut, but yeah, there was a garbage truck coming, and then it was making some weird loud sounds. I was afraid I actually recorded a sound, but I didn't. So yeah, like I was saying, um, I don't know. I don't know if you guys can hear the quotes. I love the quotes what they say. They're very awesome, but I don't know. Yeah, sorry if you can't. It's Pyongyang, I like this place. Uh, I'd prefer Grand. Actually, monuments. It's a good early game. Early game. Very good early game. What are you laughing at? Yeah, let's keep going. Slavery. I'll go to the hill and heal. Fish. Oh, oh my god, this is a nice spot. This plant city right here. I get fish. Although it sucks that I have a second like desert, because desert can't improve in this game. Like, I remember in the older, in the older civilization, uh, Civ 3. <sighs> Fuck you, scumbag. Sorry, sorry for the vulgar language, but I hate this guy. This guy has been a scumbag in my last game, and I don't like him at all. You know what? Fine, be that way. I will trade with him, and I will, I will try to make a good improvement of my relationship with him. Maybe, like, maybe the Vikings might be a scumbag now. I don't know. I don't know. If anything, I will not give free, uh, free lands to him. So I shall improve this place. I am not well. I am decent. That is good. That is good. It is from their foes, not their friends, that cities learn the lesson of building high walls. That is very, that is very true. That is very true. So I'm guessing I should do fishing now. Fishing, fishing, fishing. Expand here next for another expansion. Everyone's unhappy. Why are you unhappy? Too much people. <sighs> And, th and this place is expanding like, like a tie. Hmm. I'll build an archer for next place. I I can't do much honestly. I can't give him happy until I learn the calendar, which is which is uh probably ten turns away. Give a man a fish and you feed him for a day. Teach a man to fish, and you feed him for a lifetime. So I will go research. I'm working after this. Ooh. This is a nice spot to plant the city. Very nice. I'm living beside the jungles, but the jungles have very nice resources like this. Like, I just said nice resources. I have so much dye. I think I'll be trading. Yes, open borders, whatever. Uh, library. More defense, just in case. Mm, this is very good. 
Now, I'm worried that my commentary might cut out anytime soon because uh, I'm like what a few gigabytes away from being hard disk being full. So, you know what? I I'll come back after I render the video and I'll see how you guys think about it. You know, if you have any uh, co anything complaints, anything good about it, anything you want to tell me, go ahead and tell me in the comments for our next commentary. Um, I don't know when I'll be doing it because I'll be going on vacation this weekend. So yeah, I probably don't expect one till next week. Apologize for that if you liked it. If you don't, then you don't have to watch this. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time.